All right. Welcome back to the stream, everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. We are starting our adventures as the Arisen in Dragon's Dogma 2. I don't know why it doesn't say Dragon's Dogma 2. I don't know if it's a bug or because the creator of the series said that this is the game that they wanted the first Dragon's Dogma to be. Could be. We are rocking new game. Starting a new game will erase your previous saved data. Proceed. Do it up. <laughs> is this your final decision? You sure? Welcome back. Are you sure? Catherine, thanks for the 32 months. Hello, mister. Hello, missus. Or miss, I should say. Sorry. Catherine! Thank you very much for the 32. How you doing? Cheers. We are just about to start our adventures in Dragon's Dogma 2. It's our perfect timing. Let's go, let's go. Computer, don't explode, preferably. Definitely Cory Barlock had a similar reason why there was no DLC in God of War 2018. Respect that. Conviction is the human that will... Conviction is the human will that... Oh my god, it's... I missed it! Sorry. <laughs> it's one line and I blow it. Okay, I, I thought my game froze for a second. I was like, hey, wait a minute. There's supposed to be a, a scene going on. Okay. Good. On a guess, lend me your ears. Long as our Fevremon suffered without a true monarch to guide her hmm. and her people. No, hold on. Decades have passed since last His Majesty <laughs> Erlang. Some, something is definitely off. The throne. Long. It's like the cutscene is playing in slow have motion, we endured, dude. Yet it has not been for naught. <laughs> oh no, dude. So, something's wrong. <laughs> At last! The bell has tolled on the age of the console. At last! 2K PC. <laughs> we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Such a weird bug, isn't it, though, chat? And it's weird how it's getting better, but it was still lagging. Mm. I don't know why that's going on. No, that's still not fixed. Take 69. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's definitely still lagging. Okay, well, let's see. Let's see how it plays. That cutscene is not like super important, anyways. Which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. You can either select a prisoner to use as a preset or select the hooded prisoner to customize your character's appearance from a blank slate. Okay. Uh, Aha, I thought I recognized yeah, you. Yeah, we'll just use this and then we'll customize it from there. All right, there we go. Uh, hold on, vocation. Mage, baby. <laughs> it's, it's weird how all these voices are, they're actually not different voices, just changes in pitch. 
keep wearing my old pregnancy clothes or my boyfriend's boxers as shorts right now. Hey Sam, remember when you said you wouldn't spend the whole time in character creator? You were right. I know, right? I was spending most of it just trying to fucking fix that intro cutscene. And I don't think there's a lot of cutscenes, but oh man, if it's just laggy the whole time, that, that'd be a little, a little upsetting. <laughs> man, when I started getting these issues, I was like, wow, dude. <laughs> How is the PS5 version more appealing to me right now? Cause, cause uh, it doesn't have the lag. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, I, I definitely didn't experience that, but I mean, I didn't experience it when I was playing on PC too. It's just like my first time streaming it. It's just... This character creator is absolutely insane, guys. It's easily the most detailed one I've ever seen for any game. It's fucking wild. Okay, hold on. Light is good. I'll make it like 185. Go ahead, command. Go ahead, command. But after this roommate moves out, I can buy dressers and sort my clothes up. Nice. Make him look like me. <laughs> There's some pretty crazy uh, characters that people have made. Like some characters from Baldur's Gate 3. There's another scene after you make the character. Oh, yeah. Fuck, maybe I shouldn't take too long here then. Yo, what up, Leafu? Welcome back to the stream. Cheers, man. Happy Saturday. I've been having some tech issues with Dragon's Dogma on PC. So yeah, I had to, uh, I had to restart a few times. It's like choppiness and delay with uh, the video and the audio. Can I go 36? Head size maximum. <laughs> oh my god. That's, that's so obviously disproportionate. <laughs> Holy shit, dude, that's a little scary. Oh my god. Fucking DK head mode looking ass. Yeah, when I first, when I was landing this at my friend's place, man, I was in character creator for, for my character and my pawn for, fuck, like an hour and a half. I was going through every option. Big, big, big head mode on. Hello, happy Saturday. Good to see you, Leaf. How you doing, man? I used a tutorial on YouTube to make Geralt, but since the game is buggy, a buggy mess, I haven't bought it yet. Use him in game. Oh, nice, Brockness. Yeah, I've seen some pretty cool mods on Nexus. Yeah, it's mainly just like the skin. I don't want to, I don't want this character to look that old. You can change like elbow angle, el elbow angles and knee angles. It's wild, dude. <laughs> Leaning back. Forties <laughs> uh. good. Let's see height, torso length, muscle strength, trap size. I'm gonna have armor on most of the time, so I'm not gonna change all of these. As long as it just looks decent, it's okay with me. Chest thickness. Jeez. A 
Life is rest for us PC guys lately. I know, right? Every AAA game. Should've just stayed on PS5. Hey, so trying to tell you something. <laughs> oh man, yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to continue playing if if that lag is there. Oh, it just, it bothers me. But I won't be able to get any mods though. No. I told myself no mods though for the first playthrough even though I totally didn't follow that in, in our Fallout run. But for this, I was like, I just, I'll deal with mods later. Don't want any like potential crashes from some mods. Ooh, you suck. Who's booing me? Who's booing me? Look at these thunder thighs, dude. Those thighs are a little too thick, chat. They a little too thick. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. You released a character for free like- Oh, right, 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 I did it on there without buying the game. Nice. Well, at least um, when you do, or if and when you do get the game, Brock, this will be able to, uh, you won't have to spend time doing this. Ah, uh, character creation, you'd love to see it. I just started Cyberpunk and I wasn't prepared for penis. <laughs> Alright, you can change that in Baldur's Gate 3 as well, Jubs. Give him Waluigi type of proportion. <laughs> Was that, uh, he just has like a, a big upper body, right? And like a lanky lower body. Still remember that clip of Toro coming across the penis in Cyberpunk. I think I missed it. I felt how a woman who gets unsolicited peen pick must feel, except I kept rotating my character to make it a wake <laughs> Oh my god, dude. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay with that base head. Just make. Come on. Oh my god, it's so juicy! Yo! <laughs> Oh my god, it's so juicy. Skin sheen. Lol. I honestly can't even tell. I have to zoom in a little bit more. Isn't there like a... I think as you as the number gets higher, I think that's like all like the older ones. Let me see. Yeah, there's definitely more wrinkles on these. Make them all shiny. <laughs> Look at that glistening motherfucker. Sheesh. Hold on, I can't focus on the nips too much, dude. Twitch is gonna ban me. <laughs> I'd show you, Sam, but TOS. <laughs> Thank you, Papa. I appreciate the consideration. <laughs> yeah, stuff like skin sheen, dude. I was like, I've never seen that in a game before. But I am here for it. I just want to change the type. Yeah, I'm okay with all that stuff. <laughs> Our character's blind, Chet. <laughs> yeah, this game even lets you choose individual teeth. To, like, remove. Or is it? <laughs> right here. Just give nice, nice, nice buck tooth. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Straight clown.
ears. Make him an elf. Too big. Maybe type two. And then, yeah, adjust the lobes a little bit. Just the touch. Cheeks. I don't think I touched any of this. Hold on. Uh. Come back to those after I adjust some of this hairstyle. What kind of hairstyle do I want to give my dude? Comment. Thanks for the thanks for the bits, man. <laughs> you give him this anime here. My pawn is definitely gonna be the lion dudes. Might just stick with five. Oh God, bowl cut. Dear Lord. <laughs> this is the savior. <laughs> uh, 14? Uh, Let me compare 14 and five. Hot as fuck. Wait, where's... Hold on, I forgot how to stream. Oh, dear Christ. Hope you're having a good weekend, Katharina. Wait, Katharina, um... How's the new job? I don't think we've talked since then. Good? I hope so. Twenty-nine? A little scruff McGruff. And uh Zandia. What level what level are you? I imagine twenties, thirties? Maybe twenty-ish? No, definitely not long here. Oh my god. This looks like um if you guys Oh man, this totally reminds me of Ichiban's haircut. From uh, Yakuza, <laughs> and I mean, hey, that I think Yakuza is also Capcom, isn't it? Yeah, there's like surnames that you can give your character, and there's definitely Cap like uh, Street Fighter characters or character names that you can choose as your uh, your moniker. So, would not be surprised if that's straight up Ichiban. Why is that Zac Efron? Zach Hmm. I could see it in the face a little bit, yeah? Oh yeah, it's a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. But I feel like I'm 1000% more happier. No more toxic shit, no more bullshit, and all other things. So I'm slowly getting there since it's quite a lot to grasp there, but I'm gonna get there. Hells yeah, Katharina. You got this. Yeah, it's, it's always a little overwhelming at the beginning for sure. Just taking in, like, a lot of information and systems and processes, but... You survived your last job, so you could survive anything. Yeah, I'm I'm happy that you're yeah mo more important than anything that you're you're happier. Last job seemed to be just yeah, just did not seem good for your mental health or just I don't know everything. I feel like uh. Not situations, but places like that, that just mentally drain you and just take a toll on you like that. You can have a, you can have some permanent effects. So good on you for realizing that you're worth more than that, for finding uh, a better opportunity or a place that actually values what you have. 
straight up he looks like Zac Efron. I <laughs> definitely see it. Well, not this, not this haircut, but. <laughs> okay, I think. Okay, so it's either five. I might go with, what is it, 14? I hope they add the option for you to hide your helm. Because when I was playing uh, or my other save file, I bought like some some mage gear. And the wizard hat, I mean, it's cool. It definitely looks like a classic mage, but being able to turn that off if you want, that would be nice for sure. And then let's make our hair a little bit more black. Not like jet black, though. Eyebrows. Hold on. Uh, do I want to change this shape? <laughs> no brows. Oh God. <laughs> oh jeez. Just stick with the default, but just make it so it's not as thick. I've never heard of this game. Yeah, the first Dragon's Dogma came out many years ago. I think like 10 plus years ago. I played it just for a very, very short amount of time. But, Katharina, I know you like RPGs and open world games. And, uh, yeah, I like that this game isn't. It doesn't take place when there's only a few dragons, and that they're almost extinct. It's like full on, like, straight in the fantasy. It's like griffins, fucking chimeras, got giant ass trolls. Yeah, definitely high fantasy. I'm definitely more of a fantasy guy than I am sci-fi, so this is this is right up my alley. I might just keep it at 76. Uh, facial hair. Hmm. Give him a great big bushy beard. <laughs> Handlebar mustache there, brother. Team is super nice and company is insanely big, so there are a lot of people overall. Like, I feel... I feel like I don't end my workday and I am done or mentally drained so much I can just exist or go take a nap. I can't spend the rest of the day properly. Now it's different. I don't feel like eight hours in toxic shittery and then I'm just trying to recharge for the next day. I can still function and do normal things. It is good to hear. Definitely much happier, and also no depressive team or unhappy team people seem to... Uh, unhappy team. People seem to genuinely enjoy working there. All good news. There are always work-related problems or things to deal with, but no other background bullshit such as toxic management, company not providing things needed for work. Like, all that is gone. Everyone can just do their best at work, and also there is no pressure on me as a new person. There is proper plan what I have to do in my trial period. And that makes me way less anxious. That sounds like a fantastic report card, Katharina. I'm so happy to hear that. It's like the ideal, the ideal environment. Get along with your peers, and it's uh, yeah, no, no toxicity, no drama. There's bound to be problems that come up at work, but you know, it's like everywhere. 
but when people are uh yeah just trying to like cause drama or or have like condescending behavior or attitudes towards uh your co-workers or even if you're even worse if your higher ups are like that and that really yeah really just ugh, just drains you makes you feel even more tired having to deal with that Fucking mustache, dude. Instantly dapper. Forgot which. It wasn't like a huge beard. Not which, which facial hair I gave him. Might have been two. Sequisha. All about work, right? Ooh, I'll check the game. But by the way, majority of company stuff happens in US. Uh, not in Europe. Oh, you're talking about like the drama stuff? Yeah. Definitely like look into it, but it's a little rough right now and it doesn't run amazing on PC. I mean, I've been dealing with issues with uh, like lagginess and choppiness in the cutscene. Um, but yeah, maybe if anything, pick it up later down the down the year after they patch it up and make it run better on uh, on PC. Yeah, Captain, I'm happy to hear things are things are going better for you. Seems like they were rough for a while. Wishing you all the best on this next chapter of your life. I think I went with two. I think this I think this is the one I went with. Um on, let me go back to hair color real quick. I might make the root color like mm, a little bit more darker, maybe three, yeah. Maybe three, that's what I'm thinking. Okay. Body hair. Nah. Eyes. I don't think. I think I'm just gonna change the eye color. So hold on. Let's let's see how my character looks in different lighting. Definitely a little too pale. Sets just find like a dark brown one. Maybe twenty nine. Twenty nine's not bad. Skin. Definitely a little bit more dark. Maybe do this one. Maybe three. Yeah. 
I think three is good. I still need to beat Baldur's Gate 2 and 3 before I even consider buying any other game. <laughs> it's all good, par par. It pays the wait. <laughs> Since most games release buggy and, uh, uh, you know, not optimized, hey, the longer you wait, the... I mean, not all the time, but good chance the experience will be better. And it'll also be cheaper, so... I was thinking today, starting Baldur's Gate 3 from zero again. Oh yeah, Katrina. Um, overall experience on Baldur's Gate 3? Yeah, you like it? Um, I, what is the eyebrow color? Okay. Because my hair and the facial are, are number three, so I wanted everything to match, but eyebrows were looking a little light, so I'll make that two. Eyeshadow, Jesus. Uh, leave all that. Oh, so default actually had some eyeshadow. Give it some sheen, baby. Nope, no buck teeth. <laughs> we will keep that as is. Oh, God. The default seven. Yeah, it's okay. Tats or not. Uh, I mean, you can choose individual tattoos. Like, there's a lot of customization you can do. Yeah, no tats. Um, scars. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. My friend made, my friend made his character a uh, little like Geralt, in terms of, like on his back, dude. He's just fucking so many scars. It's so long since I started Baldur's Gate three. I'm gonna have to start from scratch again. Whenever I get into it, Sam with the beard, version broken. <laughs> I'm not trying to make him look like me. And yeah, I can never grow a beard, so let me live my fantasy, Papa. Baldur's Gate three was absolutely awesome. I definitely want to play it at some point. I think I'll wait for the uh, or, uh, the Game of the Year edition. I think that'll be the last thing that's released for Baldur's Gate 3 before they fully work on uh, the new IP. Nah, no scars. You wanna know how I got these scars? Double check. Okay. That looks okay to me. <laughs> Just hearing the pitch change. One by one sounds so funny. Where is Ilva? <laughs> Someone's having a good time there. <laughs> Somber soldier. A little bit spicy. Spicy. I think I chose Gallant Spicy. Knight 3. 
because I want him to have a little bit of that. Daddy, chill. I <laughs> mean, live my fantasy in the character creator, okay, Katharina? All right. <laughs> Bows, I'm not, I'm not worthy to be in your presence. Gachi. There are a couple things I could point out, but I will not for people that haven't played it. Thank you for not spoiling Katharina. That's definitely true. Also helps that the only thing I'd be super interested in getting anyways would be God of War Ragnarok. Dude, same. Have not played Ragnarok yet. All right. This is our good name. Sam Wise. Our moniker. Oh man, you know what I was trying to, you know what I was looking for, Parpar? Par, when I was looking through these monikers, because they have like Street Fighter characters and pretty much other Capcom IPs, they have their characters here. I was looking for, you know, I was, I was so sad to not see. They didn't have Phoenix, like Phoenix, right? Like, no, no Ace Attorney love. Ugh. They got a, uh, wait, Primrose? Oh, you suck. That's Square Enix. What the? That's a character from Octopath. Lol? Who's booing me? Oh, because they didn't have Phoenix? Yep, dude. 100%. 100%. They didn't have Ryunosuke Narahodo either. A little sad about that. I was like, no Ace Attorney love. I mean, there's a bunch of characters in Ace Attorney, so maybe some of them are represented here. Good day, Commander. <laughs> they got fucking... They got M. Bison. We got Zangief. I'm pretty sure they have Zangief. Or is it the... Yeah, dude. We're gonna go with Seminosuke. I was looking into this game yesterday. How's your experience been with it, Sam? Hey, Yami, welcome back to the stream. Cheers, by the way. Are you looking into getting it on PC or console? Regardless of the platform, there's a good foundation. I put about 10 hours on PS5 and about like a little less than 10 on PC. I'm like restarting because I wanted to do it on stream. I like what's in, I like the gameplay, the exploration. It's so much fun. Uh, the pawn system is great. I really like how the spells look as a mage, but performance is a huge thing right now. And they said they're going to be working on it. Um, so if you have other games to keep you occupied, I'd honestly say it's, it's, I'd say it's better to wait right now. If you can. And I didn't play the first game, so I've been seeing some Reddit threads where people are talking about enemy variety and monster variety. There's not as much as in the first game. But yeah, I didn't really play the first game that much, like a few hours tops. So it's pretty much, it's all fresh for me. It's all new for me, like Dragon's Dogma. They kept my lawyer out again. I know, dude. Ace Attorney is such a iconic Capcom franchise, and they didn't put him in there. Ugh. Character creator is really good. If, uh, if that's something you're wondering about, story is if you're if also if you're wanting to play this for the story, I don't I don't think you're really gonna get it here. It's it's like a pretty loose story. It seems like it's really just more focused on getting you out into the world and adventuring. Which is awesome. But yeah, performance is a pretty big issue right now. I ill like that look in your eyes. Tis queerly brazen for a pawn. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap tis only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. There's aught different about you though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Never. Add two more decades uh, on that character for accuracy. <laughs> oh, wow. I might have to wait because I was planning on getting on PC. Is it on Xbox? Uh, it is. It's on uh, Xbox Series S and X, PS5, and PC. Yeah, like I was telling Parpar, Par, the longer you wait, you know, ideally, the game will be patched up and it'll be running better. And um, maybe you could get a little bit of a discount come holiday season. Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, 
and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. But even besides all the performance issues it's and the whoa, time. who is that? Who's that? Names? <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> as soon as I started smelling it, I was like, oh, oh dear God. But it's has an unique signature. I think that's Names. <laughs> Welcome back, Names. Cheers, dude. We still in character creation? I made it. All right, we in. But even besides the performance and other drama that people have been talking about, microtransactions, the game itself, I am having a lot of fun with it, Yami. Regardless of all of that. So if they can patch it up and make it run better, yeah, that would be, yeah, that'd be ideal. Come along, you feckless dullards. Hey, fuck you, Fiska. Fucking cunt. Yeah, this game is very CPU intensive. Here, let me just settings. I'll have to change that from the main menu. Okay. But yeah, I do have to wrap up in about like 45 minutes to take uh, take out my douche. But I'll be back later on in the afternoon. Taking my dog to the groomer. I'm about to bust. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> Thank you for the bits coming. Hold on. Uh, Lul. Dude, Sam, people used to get so pissed at me when I'd beat them up. Beat them with Phoenix Wright in Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Oh, what? He was a character in there? It's awesome. Samus has spent the first hour and a half of stream customizing his game. <laughs> yeah, no, I was having some, uh, some cutscene issues with, like, the audio and the video not being synced up. Yeah, even performance right now, it's not, it's not amazing. I'm getting a, a little above 30. Do your injuries pain you? Pray, do not overexert yourself. Your input is very much valued. Yeah. Yeah, no problem, Yami. This is a good no weekend, by the way. one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. Came out of lurk to fart. <laughs> Coming back for a 24. Whoa! Oh. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. Man, the thought of doing a 24 hour. Oh man. Those are intense. Fucking pussy! Oh! <laughs> you do one! <laughs> Come here, you stream from time to time, huh? Huh? Why, why, not, why don't you walk the walk instead of tacking the tag, eh? Time for you to get to work. Work. Ugh. But it's the weekend. Sammy Chuck. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Unverified. Fake news. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. Ugh. All right. Fine. I get your boulders. Light that lantern. I will say though. That, I don't know if it's just it's the form factor of the the dual sense controller for the PS5. My hands hurt after a little bit using that controller compared to Xbox. The vicinity is quite cluttered. Pray leap. Oh, or oh, that poses a hindrance. Fuck you. Oh, I can't throw it at him. I was hoping to check it at him. Work harder! Uh, Alright, here you go, dude. A job well done. Now the next step is to... Oh! <laughs> what is this Poor dude motion? was just keeping watch and he died. We ought to investigate. Go, 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 go! Oh, yeah, I'm getting, now I'm getting below 30 FPS. But yeah, I am also streaming, so that's definitely it. So. 
a factor. Turn to stone, baby. Unverified, so there's a chance. <laughs> no. Oh shit. Here we okay. go again. You got to fell that fiend, even at the cost of your lives. Stop misinterpreting my messages, memes. Good to see memes. Welcome back, people. You know he reminds me of Chet? No! He's like a fat, bald Jafar from Aladdin. <laughs> yes, we got our staff! <laughs> I really like the DualSense, but the Series X controller is my favorite ever. It's perfect, in my opinion. It's what I'm using right now. I really like the, the the grips on the side, and um, yeah, I yeah, it's just the form factor of the controller. Uh, yeah, my thumbs hurt after a little bit. So maybe if I just got like some like a, a grip to put on top of the, the dual sense, that might make it better. Get cooked, bitch! Fuck you! You're most vulnerable when in tone your matches. Take care not to let your foes draw too near before you But should the battle turn Hold on, please. Not photo mode, hold on. Camera. Oh, camera distance is pulled back already all the way. Dyer, keep in mind that you do have recovery magic at your disposal. Cast the heal. Boulders, barrels, and the like can make effective weapons for the clever combatant. Hope you had a nice birthday yesterday. Oh no. They're turning our friends into stone. Sal, bitch. Drop by to say hi. Heading out in like 10 minutes. All sounds getting good. No problem, no problem. Have a nice Are birthday weekend. Are you heading over to your sister's place? You all see while you can. After all, got myself a millionaire's see. moose sunday. Oof. In this place forever. Give me some deeds, jobs. Sounds rich. You have lost your memory. Staying home this weekend, Come but this seeing way. friends. Nice. Let us flee. Have an awesome time. Halt. Halt, I say. Oh shit, did end. You must jump. That is the only path. Ah! Ah! 
layers of chocolate mousse, some cream, caramel sauce, and a base of buttery cookies. Oh! Share, please. That sounds delicious. No one could survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn. Don't just stand there! Shoot it down! It's getting away! Bring it down! Bring it down! Peace out, bitches! Go now, lost soul. And learn all you can of this world you must protect. Protagonist loses memory? Why hasn't anyone else ever used that as a story mechanic before? I know, right? <laughs> Innovative storytelling. And it begins. Yeah, I really don't know why Dragon's Dogma 2 is not the title card. I'm very curious. I can't wait to fight these griffins. They look so sweet. It's Friday, so it's been pizza and nuggets for dinner too. Nice. Got myself some Coke Zero and some meds. Had a bout, a uh, bad bout of flu past two days. Oh no. Hope you get well soon, Jubs. Worry not for me. The brine may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a rift stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi, are you all right? What happened here? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next, and now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? The, uh, the motion capture is not that great. It's definitely, definitely a little janky. Bought the wrong game. I'm not calling it Dragon's Dogma 2 because they're subliminally suggesting you play DD1 until this shit is fixed. <laughs> His dream came true. He was killed by a hentai monster. It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Okay. Um, let me just save real quick. And let me adjust to the settings here.
borderless window. Okay, and just turn motion blur and depth of field off. Lens distortion, turn that off. And ray tracing off. Okay. Follow Justin with two N's. Justin. All right, let's roll, baby. We out here. Give me those goodies. Let the pack rat behavior commence. Yeah, right now I'm getting around like 50, 50 ish FPS. Where exactly is this jail you say you escaped from, anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly not like that here in Vermont. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Batal? Bahu? Nay. Bahu? Yes, that's unlikely. Batal? I've estranged from Batal ever since the war. <sighs> it's difficult to imagine. Where are you going? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Hold on. I'm exploring here. There could be a chest here. Fuck you. Hold on. I've actually never climbed up here. Hold on. Hold on. There may be something cool here, chat. Or nothing. There's only one way to find out. We're on an adventure. All right, okay, okay. Oh, wait. Where do you think you're going? Hey. You can't just run off now. Calm down, Justin, with two ends. <laughs> yeah, like... Man. Oh, how... I don't know how you got up here. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, Justin, with two ends, are you uh, also part witch? Teach me your ways. That lip sync, I know, it's not, it's not great. It's not great at all, Brockness. <laughs> it's pretty janky. Yeah, this game's got some jank, 100%. But I, st I still love what's, what's there as a foundation. That's one of, like, the key things that keeps me hooked into an RPG. Is the, uh, the sense of exploration and rewarding you for it. When you go off the beaten path and then it's just a cool view, I mean, like, that's nice, but, you know, when, when you find, like, a hidden chest, like, oh, man, that just feeds the exploration so much more. Uh, that motherfucker almost jumped off the cliff. <laughs> Where are you going? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Yeah, you, you're, you're having plenty of words now, okay? Keep talking. On the road again. That's a nice view. Gotta get out of these rags, though. Ugh. Stop staring at my calves, chat. All right. Stop staring at my legs, okay? You gotta be a tier three subscriber for that, can't you? He's part goat. <laughs> he just like rams me. I'm like, oh, I think you're right, memes. <laughs> Lul. <coughs> Fine. Goblins. Goblins. Which reminds me, next Witcher game is starting development in a few months. They're past the, they're past the concept stage and have over 400 people ready to start working on it. Holy shit! Let's take up your weapons, sir. You You'll excited, Parkour? Next Witcher, Witcher Four. Path. If you find your strength flagging, I hope Witcher One, the remake. I hope that turns out good because I want to play it. Kung Pao type of lip sync. <laughs> That's a lot of nuts. Hidden collectibles, hidden collectibles make me tingle. Had that fun with. Oh, in Titanfall 2? What? I didn't. Wow, I didn't think that type of game would have that, but that is awesome. It's only helmets, but cool to explore and get something for it, especially 
as it's a bit of a puzzle. Yeah, no, exactly. I'm a curative or have a bit of green warish. Hold on. I'm like still just trying to get the audio balance right. All right, goblins. When one of the fiends comes, let's guard or dodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. Yeah, effects still sound a little too loud. Make use of the slope. It will give you an advantage against their ranks. Employ guarded attacks to get the enemy to flinch. Get cooked. Random attacks are more destructive but will leave you vulnerable. So seize your chance to land one the moment the enemy flinches. That was ragdoll physics. You love it. Do not let yourself be swarmed by enemies in number. Best to draw them away from the horde and pick them up one by one. <laughs> there are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're well noted, Justin with two ends. Thanks, mate. <laughs> 